Hello everyone, welcome to the MSSA channel. This is the first fishing video we've done now. Uh, we've done an intro one, but this is the first time we've been out since that. Today you find us on the beautiful Cable Bay in Anglesey. There's only myself and Richie managed to get up today, the rest of the lads are working. But it's only a small rock anyway really, so you can only get a couple of us on it anyway, so not too bad. Going to be having a look today for Thornback Rays, Bullos. Hopefully we'll get a few and we'll keep in touch during the course of the day with you. But yeah, um, beautiful day. It's absolutely stunning today. Another fella just turned up on the corner of the rocks there as well. So yeah, hopefully we'll see a few fish between us today. Day. all quiet on the western front at the minute odd uh, big velvet swimmer crab having a little uh, go at the baits but uh, all pretty quiet it's we're four hours down to low now so uh, you know what ray fishing's like it's nothing for a while and then it all goes crazy so uh, Jay's lost a couple of sets of gear um, so we just keep plugging the baits out big baits and uh, sit on it and just wait for the fish to turn up or come on the feed so uh, I shall see you later and hopefully we'll have some fish to show you but I uh, just go through the rigs we're using with you today in the baits using dongles today six over of our circles underneath them uh, above them sorry on a loop with with the dongle the circle look at it doesn't really bother me whether it's snelled or looped. It's never really made much difference to me. Um, 80 pound, right the way through. Onto an up and over pulley. Seven ounce leads. Basically that's it for today. It's just going to be squid, bluey. That's a squid and bluey wrap on a dongle. As I say, six over of us above it on a, on a loop. Um, I seem to find with the dongle what happens is every fish you hook is hooked in the mouth especially with rays and you tend to get a better fight off them as well I think it's because it's not ripping the guts out once the hooks are in so because it's in the lip you do get a better fight off the rays people say rays don't fight but believe me rays do fight especially when you get them on these dongles in deep water so yeah we'll just keep cracking on as I say squid and bluey we've got mackerel a few sardines as well to try, very oily, so give them a go as well today. But yeah, we'll keep bashing on, see how we get on. So, tackle today, centric scalibur sea curves, hand casting specials, season, with 18 pound line on, and uh, the left hand rod, a long poly dropper, squid and bluey. On the right hand rod, we've got a shorter pulley dropper with a dongle 6 0 very much with a whole squid and a whole fillet of mackerel on it. So uh, that's the setup, you just need the fish. The tackle I'm using today, a pair of Pen Fathom casting specials, 20 pound line straight on them with 80 pound leaders. Um, the reason why you like using the fathoms on here is it's just mainly just for the amount of line they hold really. They just hold a stupid amount of line which is ideal for the rocks. Um, I've got SL30s in my bag just in case we need to go a little bit bigger. The right hand rod is an Akios Air Power GTR prototype which I've been testing for the last, I don't know, I've had it for probably about eight or nine months now. It's, a, it's actually a glass tip rod to be honest. It's a, got glass about 18 inches down the tip but don't let that fool you this thing casts 220 gram plus bait all day long it's absolutely an incredible rod and the left hand rod is an Akios Creed prototype which I've had for probably eight months nine months been testing that for eight and nine months now it's absolutely solid the Creed it's an absolute beast of a rod yeah but we'll just see how we get on with them big baits big leads let's just get on with it Let's 
solid. Hi, folks. So, still all quiet. We've actually uh, decided we weren't really happy where we were. Jay was losing a lot of gear, so we've moved along a little bit to where we fished on here last time. So, uh, just got two rods back out now. Jay's got two out. Sea's calming down a little bit on the swell. So, uh, fingers crossed some fish putting an appearance, but all quiet at the moment, so... Uh... Okay, first bite of the day on the left hand rod, which is the Creed prototype. Really good pull down that as well. Here we go again. Just give it a little bit of time because it's on a dongle. So I'll let it swallow the bait first and then the circle hook will roll into its jaw then. Here we go. Definitely looks like a ray to me. Could be a doggy though, but it does look like a ray. Jay's just had one as well, so hopefully the start of a bit of a feeding spell. Here he comes. Two little rays. Let's hope it's a start. Okay, the rays have turned on now. 
Again, dongle rig. Here's the bait, the hook in the jaw again. Every single time on the dongle. Let's hope we get a few more now. It's starting to hear. Uh, looks like they've turned on after a few hours. A few hours by well, a couple of bites. Um, but that's two cast, two rays each, so fingers crossed. There's number three, incredibly spiky, <laughs> both sides, as on a bluey squid wrap, but uh, he's wrapped up in his tail, he's got so many spines. Yeah. Look at, I don't know if you can see the tail on that, but that is thorn back <laughs> to the power end so get him unhooked get this one back in the water just had the bike developing there on the left hand rod um, no it looks like another ray to be honest but when you use the dongle rig you've got to just give them that little bit longer I think just so they can get the hook in because they've got to get rid of all that bait first and then the hook will go in so just give it a little bit longer don't rush it take your time you know, don't don't strike straight away if you use a dongle. But to be honest, you don't even need to strike with them. You just reel into them. Don't don't strike at all. Just nice gentle reel. Lean back and just reel in. Another ray. Really, really pull back hard with this. Really gives great fishing a whole new meaning, this does. This one's going absolutely ballistic. This thing's giving me some stick out there. This rod's the Akios Creed prototype. Absolute powerhouse of a rod. This ray's giving it a proper good work out here. And it's all because it's lip up by the dongle. They just don't, they just seem to fight so, so much better. And like I've said previously, all these people who think rays don't fight, honestly, try one on a dongle. Hook one on a dongle and a 6 0 circle hook right in its jaw. You'd be absolutely amazed how hard Ray's fight. Especially in deep water like this, a cable. As you see, oh, he's just come up to the top now. God, oh, he's off again now. God knows where he's going. There he goes, he's dived again. You just dive and dive and dive with this dongle, it's unbelievable honestly. You've really, really got to give it a go. So much better for the fish as well. They're not getting hooked down at gizzards. You now every one of them is hooked right in the jaw. And there you have it. And they're not massive fish these either. They're not massive fish. But the power of them with the dongle is absolutely incredible. And there you have it. And I'll prove a point, I won't even unlock, unlock it, I'll just show you where the dongle is as soon as I can land it. There you go. Every single one, right in the scissors. Every single one. That's how you do it. The dongle, honestly, definitely the way forward for rays. But lovely fish, amazing how they differ here. You get some of them absolutely covered in thorns, and some of them with hardly any thorns, but this one's not many really. It's 
door going off now. It's just gone absolutely crazy for them. It's strange, we get we get like loads of bites, loads of fish, and then it just dies, completely dies, and then we both get a load of bites again. It's just yeah, it's mad. They're all nice sized fish though to be fair. Proper little scrappers as well. But believe me, you've got to give that dongle a go, everyone. Give it a go, it's so much better for fish care. Every one of them's hooked in the jaw. The fight you get off them is ten times better as well. Honestly, give it a go. Yes, again, the dongle will do what the dongle does. Perfectly in the jaw every single time. Another ray. Every single one of them we've had today has been hooked like that. Superb fights off every single one too. Yes again. Lip hook.
said it goes flat and it fell a swim off. So, uh, nice huff out, 9.15, just not quite the double, but uh, I'm not complaining, lovely fish, so uh, get this one back, I've got a ray that I've got to show you as well, the best ray of the night. And yet another ray. Ray and a it's, half. It's just gone mad again. But it's what we come for. You know, another ray and a half. I just think there's another ray as well on the other rod. There you go. Great session up here tonight. Best ray of the session for me. Beautifully marked fish. So uh, another one out on the uh, dongle rig, as was the Huss, so uh, yeah, working well. We have a nice Huss, just been weighed 11 pound nine. Absolutely giving me a nightmare here. <laughs> I call these the gangsters of the sea, because they're just tough as our boots. But he's not a happy fella, this one. He really ain't happy. Oh yeah, it's absolutely huge this thing. Proper scrap. Lovely fish, one of my favourite fish. Let's get it back. They've all, they've all been pretty much around the same size. I've lost count of how many we've had now. Some lovely rays up to about seven pounds. Uh, Richie's had a horse, an ounce under 10 pound it was. And mine was 11 pound nine. So all in all, absolutely brilliant day on cable. And again, it just shows you how good that dongle rig is. Every single fish we've had tonight, has been lip hooked, they've all gone back, minimal bleeding out the lips, absolutely fantastic the dongle, you need to have a go with it honestly, 6-0 six six circle hook above a dongle, just let the bites develop a little bit longer than normal, every single fish is hooked directly in the jaw there, absolutely superb session on cable, thanks for watching guys, appreciate it. <laughs>